Hey, a federal district court in Florida rules, and this is devastating, the health care law unconstitutional. That's right. And Florida Governor Rick Scott agrees. He says people, not the government, should have more control over their health care decisions. He joins us live from Tallahassee. Good morning to you, sir. Good morning. That's, it's great that the, uh, the judge made that decision. More importantly than holding the mandate unconstitutional, he said if the mandate's unconstitutional, the whole bill is unconstitutional. So, you know, we need to go back to give us our own rights. Let us as citizens decide what we want. And in, in particular, Florida, we want to decide what we want to do about health care. Sure. We don't need the federal government telling us. Uh, Governor, I guess that's exactly why you're smiling today, because you're not going to have that yep. additional burden. Now, you talked to Health and Human Services uh, Secretary Kathleen Sevillas yesterday. The states can't afford what's mandated in this plan anyway, that Medicaid has got to expand to the point where you don't have the money. Right. You know what they need to do is they need to just give us a block grant. Let us make a decision. We know what Floridians need. We know what our safety net should be. Don't be telling us how to spend our money. Uh, so this is a this is a great step. It's a great step for the country. It's a great step for Florida uh, that this case was uh, that the uh, Affordable Health Care Act was it's not affordable. First off, was declared unconstitutional and right. completely thrown out. So now uh, the Department of Justice on behalf of the uh, administration is going to yeah. go ahead and appeal it. So we'll stand by for that. In the meantime, uh, you are unveiling your first budget right here on Fox and Friends right. uh, officially February 7th. But what's the headline, sir? Yeah. Well, we're going to be the most most fiscally conservative state in the country. I'm, I'm, we've got a $3.6 billion uh, budget deficit. Yep. I'm going to wipe that out. On top of that, we're going to reduce property taxes, and we're going to begin phasing out the business tax. We're going to make it so every business in this country wants to do business in Florida because we're the most we're the place that people can do the, can you know we're fair to uh, businesses and also fair to our taxpayers. How are you going to do it, Governor? Because uh, someone's got to pay the price for that. And how are you going to do it? Well, what we're doing is we're going through it's accountability budgeting. We're going through every agency and saying, how do we spend money? One, should we should state government be doing that uh, any any longer? Was it a good program 20 years ago? <clears throat> and we're figuring out which agency can do things better. So we're streamlining. Over first uh, announced yesterday, over a billion dollars of savings through things such as you know consolidating right. services and, and things like that. Well, I'm sure that uh, our Floridian viewers who uh, just heard you say you'd like to lower property taxes are going yippee. Meanwhile, I understand your state is going after the municipal unions because it's one of the few states, maybe the only state, where employees, <clears throat> state employees don't actually pay into their pensions. Well, two things. One, I want to make sure that our pension fund is, is viable, so we've got to make sure there's money there. Second, it's only fair, just like the private sector, if you, if you work at a private company, you're contributing to your pension plan. Right. Uh, state workers should work, pay, contribute to theirs. So that's what we're going to ask them to do from now on. And that would help balance the budget. And uh, the details are going to be uh, released in a couple of days. Thanks so much for giving us a sneak preview, Governor, as you look to balance your budget like so many other states. Governor uh, Rick Thanks Scott, so. thank you. All right. Have a great day. You too.